Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a video using the Morphe uh, 35V palette. I have been obsessed with this palette along with the Too Faced Gingerbread palette. The colors in here, and this is new, I got this during Black Friday at Ulta, are absolutely stunning and I don't know, I just really, 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 really like them. So I'm going to take this Morphe Bullet Crease Brush and pick up the color... What color is this one too? One, two, Risk. Risk. Right there. Just been enjoying filming lately. I hope you guys can see these eye looks that I'm doing because that's like the main focus for me right now. I keep wanting to go into a different color. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start doing Christmas looks too. I already got ideas, like, written down for every day. So I'm going to be filming every day now, pretty much, unless something comes up. Okay, now I'm just going to blend. And then we're going to pick up the color on the same brush, because this brush is perfect for the crease. Um, let's see what's the next one we want to do. That one, which is third row, one, two, three. There's the fourth color. Called Turned On. It's like an orangey color. Turned on. I haven't been turned on in a long time. <laughs> TMI. But my husband has been working night shift and he sleeps during the day. So I get no uh, lovey dovey. I mean, I haven't, honestly, I haven't been thinking about it because I quit smoking, so I'm on the patch. So I've been trying to keep myself busy, and that has not been on my mind, but, you know, once in a while, I do need a little something, something. And I'm not getting it, so... <laughs> oh my god, I'm just fucking with you people. But it's the truth, though. I'm just telling you like it is. I need some loving... Give me some loving. Alright, now we're gonna go in with the crease. In the crease again. Jesus, with the same brush. <clears throat> we're gonna go into this color down here, which is... Spice. Oh, it's so pretty. Let me tell you, I'm going to be doing so many different looks with this palette. So get ready, people. I did a couple of Norbina um, palette looks. I don't really like that palette. I like the Lorac Pro 4 better. It's the same concept. It's purple. The shadows are much better. Honestly, I just don't like the Norvino um, eyeshadow palette. I'm going to keep it, but I just don't care for it. I probably won't use it. I mean, once in a while I will, but... Alright, let's pick a lid color. Um... Alright, let's see. Let's 
do third row, third color, Vixen. Jesus, come on, man. Vixen, we can't even say it. it's like a pinky color. Or we can do, I don't want to do gold. Or we can do, what's the other, what's the one above that? Lust. Let's try, let's try Lust. Let's do Lust and mix and mix together. Mm-hmm. Yep. Lust and Vixen. I want to do some blue looks. I need a good yellow too. You don't even need to wet your brush. So that was Lust and Vixen mixed together. All right, now we're going to go back into the crease with this flat brush from Morphe with this pink matte shade, which is called Thrust. I don't know, maybe we should do something different. Well, let's see what it looks like. Mm. Okay, that's nice. going all the way in the crease anyway. Mm-hmm. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty. And then we're going to take the smaller shade of brush and go into the color. Because I want to go right on the side of the tape here. Or... Wild Thing. It's like a burgundy color, I'm guessing. I don't know. Wild thing. You make my heart sing. You make everything groovy. That's a pretty color.
why does this eye always do that? God. Fucking bitch. Now we're gonna have to go back into that color because this eye... Always does that. I don't know why. Fuck. It's not a blending brush. This eye always comes out so much better. I don't but now we're going to have to go back into, um, Lust and Vixen. This is one of my new favorite palettes. I highly recommend it. Fuck the Jacqueline Hill palette. You don't need that shit. Right now, I'm not going to prime my face because this Makeup Revolution Stick Foundation is so creamy that I don't need to and I'm not going to use a lot you don't need a lot I know I'm like I don't need a lot and then I pound that shit on myself with the curling iron on the top of my head right here. Sorry, I'm looking in my mirror. Let me know if you like the filming in the bathroom. I like filming outside too, but just let me know if you like it in the bathroom. I already filled in my eyebrows with the NYX brow pencil. I see a lot of people who do foundation who always forget their ears or their or their neck or like the sides of the nose right here, like the inner part. I see a lot of people do that. Why? I don't know. Too lazy or they just forget? I don't know. But this Makeup Revolution stick foundation will last me all day and night. I don't have to reapply. 
Same with every other stick foundation that I have using. That I have using. That I have used. Another thing I recommend is this Cover FX Concealer. It is $32, but it is well worth the money. Thanks to Amrezy for showing this on Instagram. Um, they sell it at Ulta, that's where I got it. I saw her using it and I fell in love with the coverage. And when I saw it at Ulta during Black Friday, I had to snatch it. And I'm going to get another one. Because I use I've been using it every day since I got it. Let me tell you, nothing beats my It Cosmetics by by under eye. But this is the second best concealer that I have ever used. Um, it's better than the Tarte Shape Tape to me. That's the third best concealer. This one definitely beats the Tarte Shape Tape. So it's the... Um... Uh... It Cosmetics Bye Bye and Dry, the Cover FX, and then the Tarte Shape Tape. Those are my three favorite concealers that I will use. And I don't like liquid foundation anymore. Like, I'll use it, but the only liquid foundation I'll use is, like, It Cosmetics um, or Estee Lauder Double Wear, Giorgio Armani. Do a face bore in this way or like drugstore foundation. Other than that, I don't use liquid foundations. I have been using stick foundations for so long now that I, I, I just love them. And I've been using the shit out of the Kat Von D translucent powder because I want to use it up. I used up two Cover FX translucent setting powders. Two of them. And the Laura Mercier one I still have, but I don't really, I mean, I like it, but I want to use up the Kat Von D one, so that's why I've been using it every day. I'm hitting pan on a lot of shit, because I want to use it, a lot of it, you know, because some of the stuff I've had for so long, you know what I mean? So I have to you use it up like every once in a while I'll switch out the products. I've hit pain on so many things. I'm wearing a Gryffindor shirt I got this from Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I love it. What's next? Okay. Next, we're going to do mascara. We're going to do Maybelline Lash Sensational. I haven't used this one in a hot minute. My favorite drugstore mascara is the CoverGirl Lash Blast. I also like the Catrice one, and I like that one as well. My favorite high-end mascara is the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara, the Tarte Man Eater Mascara, and the Benefit, what is it called? I don't know, the roller one. Yeah. Alright, next we're going to do No, we're not bad, we're not bad. Cat Bondi bronzer. See I'm trying to use up like tomorrow. I'll probably switch up the products. Like the bronzer and oh, that was pigmented. Holy shit. Yeah. 
Yeah, tomorrow I'll switch up the bronzer, blush, and highlight. I'm so sad that Once Upon a Time ended. Thank God for Netflix because that is my favorite show. I can't believe they just ended it. That's because they brought in new people who sucked. Some of them were good, but most of them sucked. They should have just kept all of the old people and left it the way it fucking was. Milani Blush and Luminoso. No, right? Like Emma and... I know Rumpel was on there. He's my favorite character, but they should have kept Emma, Snow, Charming, all of them. The, the, the dwarves, Granny, you know, all of them. From the beginning, all them characters. They should have kept them all on there. Mac... Prep and Prime, Fix Plus, Rose Scent. Oh my god, I really love this one. I want to get the other one too. The other scented one. Laura Geller, Gilded Honey. Highlight, I'm just going to take this little brush. Put it on my lips. 21 minutes. I'm actually going to use it for this, too. I don't know. Why not? So, yes, expect videos from me. Every day, probably, unless something comes up like this. And what else? Why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? Oh, dear. Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick and Cool Girl. This is almost gone. That's why I'm using it again. It's literally like almost gone. There's only like a, a little bit left in there. Mm-hmm. Uh, brow bone highlight. I'm not going to do the waterline. I really don't like doing the waterline. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I'm going to pick up the color Knockout. Which is like a white shimmer. And I'm going to put eyeliner on and we're all done. I like the way this look came out. What do you guys think? Hmm. Oh, it goes my expensive brush and an inner corner highlight. Which will be shameless. You can't even see that. Let's do swipe right. That's better. All right. It cosmetic. It cosmetics. Next. Slide on, glide on, eyeliner and black. That was not a fart. Those are my shoes. Chill out, people. If I farted, I would tell you. It sounded like a fart, though. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just my shoes. I would never fart on camera. <laughs> Trust me. It was my 
my shoes always make noises like that. My husband always thinks I'm farting when my shoes do that. They're the Skechers like air. And I got like, let's see if I can lift my leg up, foamy like shit on the bottom. So they make weird noises when you move. Plus my stomach is growling as well, so... <sighs> I haven't been feeling good lately. It's probably because of the quitting smoking. I don't know. I haven't been sleeping good. Where's my top? Alright guys. Good set. my look using the Morphe 35V palette. And I just dropped it. So, where did it go? Alright, thank you guys for watching. Have a beautiful day and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye!